Hey guys, so if you want to see how I did this bomb Valentine's Day look, please stay tuned and continue watching. <laughs> Okay, so for this eye look, I already have my lids primed and set. We're gonna go ahead and jump into this video. So, starting with my trusty dusty Ace Butte palette, Beauty palette, and I'm gonna put that at the top. And I did a look earlier that could be for Valentine's Day. I did not record it. It is on my Instagram at Ashanti Diana. Um. But if you guys want to see how I did that one, just let me know. So I'm going to go ahead and get into this. And this is the shade Clove. Next, I'm going to go into my Masquerade palette. And I'm going to go into Hidden Secret, which is actually a blush. But I'm going to get into that blush since I don't really use it as a blush it's too too light for me I feel like I would be just looking like a rose I don't know I don't know it's not it's not for me sis it's just not oh my god in my hair whatever So drag that all the way out. Then I'm gonna go into Teddy Brownie Points. And I'm just gonna pat that into my crease area. And my crease area is so little. And I'm just using this brush to just diffuse the color because this, this is my brush, bro. It's so soft. This is my Alamar brush, by the way. And I'm actually tired of using the back of my hand. I need to get a little something else okay so I am going to cut my crease pretty deep and by deep I mean the way I'm cutting it in the corner Start the other side just so I can make sure it's even.
I'm setting my lids with some powder. Okay. Now, a little spray my flathead brush and I'm gonna dip into proof and I'm putting oh that's not even oh I cannot see I'm going to even it up as I'm doing this so I'm just putting proof on that inner corner I don't know why I didn't have a mirror in front of me. And take proof across and bring it across the top and even up my cr cut crease as I do since it is a lighter color. I actually really didn't even need to do the um, concealer part because this is a light color and kind of don't matter. So I took proof, proof. I'm saying proof. Ploof. P-L-O-O-F. Yeah. So anyways, I went from the inner corner and then cut across the top of my cut crease with ploof. With my flat head. Not screwdriver, my flat brush. But don't know why I refer to who stuff like it's in, like it's tools so next I'm gonna go into how you one and I'm gonna set that right under and next to ploof And like I said before, with foils, your finger is the best, but for the sake of placement, I'm just going to use my brushes and make sure that they are wet so that they these colors foil over. Okay, after I use I use on. I'm gonna go into cranberry splash on the other side of the brush and put that on the outer most part. Oh, and that's foiling over so perfectly. And I'm gonna blend it in with how you join. before I get my blending brush. Like there's a little space. Like uh, where you can see kind of through my um, how you doing and I'm just gonna fill that in with the cranberry splash so it blends evenly. Now I am going to take my blending, or no, I use that one.
Now I'm gonna take my blending brush and blend those colors together so I don't look like a damn clown. Cause I ain't nobody fool. use my flat end of my brush just to blend the front color down closer to that um, ploof so it has an even transition all the way through and I'm kind of blending the foils with a flat brush now, I'm going to go into Wine and Dine and put that on the outermost part and blend it in. It's a wine color that I use so often. I love this color. It is so beautiful. I kind of bring it up a little bit I'm gonna go ahead and put on my liner okay so now that my lashes are done and I pretty much knocked over everything in my background I'm gonna go ahead and line my lips no nope, not Yes, I am. I'm going to use bear berries by god knows who only god knows because apparently the name has wiped off and it actually has a very berry smell to it I'm gonna pop a little bit of matte lip liqueur by RX RX by Kiss, and I was gonna put that in the very center. I literally gotta blend my big old lips like a thousand times for them to be right, and it's. Drying faster than I blend. 